Okay guys, today we're gonna take a look at a problem that uh, a lot of us probably have had or still have. And it is the thumbnail loading time. I'm gonna go to my six terabyte uh, hard drive right here. And let's go to a folder here, for example. As you see, they are loading, but not good at all. And same goes for other folders that haven't been for example checked or whatever and as you see most of them don't even open so but for privacy reasons i might blur them a little bit so i hope you get the point what i'm trying to show you here and to get that we need two pieces of software one is optional one is mandatory isn't there infinite wisdom windows decided to get rid of the thumbnail cache and we have this app right here called WinAero Tweaker. And let me go to the help page, go about. And this is WinAeroTweaker.com or WinAero.com. These are their sites. And you can go there and take a look if you so need. And now here, what you need, you, you'll see this page in the beginning. You'll be here at this home. But we have to search for thumbnail. And we go to the first one that says behavior or keep thumbnail cache or cache. I'm gonna hit here. I'm gonna hit keep thumbnail cache. Now this app has a lot of other stuff that in another video I will go through it. But for this case, we are talking about the thumbnails because that's quite a big deal. We hit okay here. Let me just make sure that I hit it. Close this one here. And the second app will be when thumbs preloader or windows thumbnails preloader i'm gonna run it as administrator it is yes and as you see right here it is already opened up right now and here it says uh, blah 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 website brahov.com when thumbs preloader it's run right here b-r-u-h-o-v dot com slash forward when thumbs Preloader. Okay, we are clear so far. Now let's go back to our uh, hard drive and let's take another look. For example, as I said, I might, I might blur these for privacy purposes because these are all family photos and I don't want to put anything on the internet. So now let's go here. That was not loading compared to how it was before. This is perfect. I. I don't think it has ever loaded this fast and that applies to photo thumbnails and video thumbnails alike and let's open this folder here and as you see video thumbnails if you know anything about videos especially from a hard drive they are not the easiest thing to load and as you see right here it's actually loading them really really good compared to how it used to load before the software because obviously it's not going to be perfect because my hard drive is quite old and yes these uh, videos and all these files that you're seeing here are on a separate hard drive these are not on my main uh, computer or disk c what how some of us might call it but that's just how good it does for example there's videos here that are my previous time and the second software now that i showed you that i said it's optional the wind thumbs preloader well when you go to this folder let's say for example here i have a lot of videos or photos or both you right click and you will have this option here wind thumbs preloader if you click preload thumbnails it will preload only what's on the root of this folder which means this stuff here but if you wanted to preload what's on the root of the folder plus what's inside the folders themselves then you go right click and you hit preload thumbnails recursively this will take time depending on your computer depending on how many files you have in your drive right there in this one there is uh, mostly 4k videos and you see how that may not be the best idea to do to preload all the thumbnails but for the sake of this video i had to click it and i just wanted to share this with you guys and uh, it was just too good not to share it with you 
Because I know I've been so frustrated so many times, at least after Windows 7, because we had that option in Windows 7, and after 7, yeah, that's gone. That when I finally, finally found these, I just, I had to let you all know about it. And now, we can just go inside here, you can open it, large icons, and as you see, everything inside is already preloaded. And I believe this is great, and you go any folder, as you see, videos inside the folders are already preloaded. Just think of it as when you're in a really chill, frozen winter, that you wish you had a way to start your car, let it warm up a little bit, and you can go in it when the car is warm, or vice versa on summer. You wish you could turn your car on and the AC blast it and you go into a cold car. Well, that's how I see this one here. I see it as warming up or chilling out my car before I get in in the respective season. And now, with that said, I hope you learned something from this video and I hope you found it useful at least if nothing else that it will help you find your files and load your files faster in the future and as i said i will take a more in-depth look at this software for you guys in the future but for today we're gonna cut it out here because we only needed those thumbnails to take a look at our files and we will see you next time i'd appreciate it if you hit like and subscribe bye